In this video, I'll show you how to enter, edit, and delete text and numbers in an Excel spreadsheet. Whenever you want to modify the content of a cell, you first have to select it. You will know that you have selected a cell thanks to the borders that the cell will have once it is selected. In addition to that, the respective row and column of the cell will be highlighted as you can see here. I've selected D4 and column D and the fourth row are highlighted. It is quite easy to enter content in a selected cell. You should simply start writing. For example, I'll type the days of the week. We will have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and so on. In order to tell Excel to accept the value that we have written, we can hit Enter, one of the arrow keys, or Tab. The difference is that if you hit Enter when entering the data, the next cell that you will be at is the one below, while Tab will instead move you to the right. We have the same thing with numbers. Next to each of the days of the week, I'll type the numbers from 1 to 7. You can see that Excel aligns text to the left and numbers to the right. This allows us to understand how Excel reads the data that we've entered. Let's type another number below our column. For example, 8. It is quite possible that sometimes when you start modifying a cell, you will change your mind about doing it. By pressing the Escape key, the modification that you made would not be carried out. As you can see, I typed 8, but then pressed the Escape key and the cell remains blank. None of the changes that I performed during edit mode are performed. We can use the F2 key when we need to edit the content of a cell. It activates the formula bar and we can start writing. We can change the content of the cell and then click Enter. If you want to delete the content of a cell, then you have two options. Use the delete button on the keyboard or the clear command in the home tab. The difference between the two is that delete leaves any previous formatting that you had, while clear is able to remove the entire content of the cell. This is how you enter, edit, and delete data in Excel. In our next lesson, we will learn how to format our spreadsheets. Thanks for watching.